that. It's hard for me to let go, actually. Very. So that I can do it with you, that's actually a new thing for me. New mm. experience, I'm liking it. I've never had an interaction like this. But I feel there's a big part of me that's like, how can you trust, uh... And there's like this little part that just wants to kind of fuck with everything. We put this video together to give you more information about our new program, Getting Her World. And we are living what it is that we're teaching, not that we don't mess up and have a lot of learning, but how can we show a sense of what really happens in our lives when we relate. That has all of us either moved or laughing so hard we're hurting or, uh, or closer than ever. And I wanted guys to be able to see that. And it's tough to capture that. And it's tough to teach it. And Garrison was like, we're going to capture this. And he had an enticing way to get me to do that. The most fun idea I could possibly come up with to show that would be to stick Decker in a room with a bunch of beautiful women and just see what happens. There's a, there's a role that he's in. Mm. He's the cop. It's a good role to play. You like, <laughs> you like that role? Yeah. I don't know you that well, we're on film. Can I really dive into that territory? Mm, don't think this is the place, but. Could be. Part of the challenge of AMP for seven years now has been to isolate what, what's the difference here that makes the difference? And that's, that's what I was interrogated by Brian about over and over again. And I think this is it. Even when I had zero social skills by any societal standard I know of, still able to have really rewarding relationships with women and, uh, and getting phone numbers, getting dates, all the things that uh, it seemed like I shouldn't be doing, came down to the core principle of getting her world in a profound way. Not as a formal interview, and not as a burden, but as a genuine co-discovery. Let's check it, you wanna check it out more? Okay. This is totally what I, if we were on a, I would love to be on a date with you. <laughs> You'll get breakthroughs and insights for yourself by watching Decker and Garrison debrief each interaction the opportunity to play by play critique where I take it, where she goes with it, and see for yourself how you can sharpen your own uh, taste for what a rewarding interaction can be. It's like taking this little moment in time, kind of sticking my hands in and opening it up and just saying like, oh, wow, there's a lot going on here. Let's see if we can understand it, make sense of it. Slowing things down so I could study it, so I could really get what the clutch moments were. Be like, oh, how would I respond to that? Or what, what worked and what didn't about that? That makes a difference for me. Getting Her World can help you create unforgettable conversations with women you've just met. It's great to be able to have even a one minute interaction that sticks in her mind for weeks, especially with guys who get masterful at techniques to get a phone number as if that's this uh, holy grail and then she doesn't call back or it, there's layers and layers of getting what seems like success but still not getting uh, anything other than the booby prize, not getting that rich personal connection. It makes a huge difference when there's men coming and going into a woman's experience throughout the day, through throughout the, the evening for her to be impacted, not just conceptually but emotionally, bodily impacted by what could seem like a casual conversation. It's hard to meet people at first. Not a lot of people know how to actually meet a new person and bring their real self. In this video, it becomes possible. It's like, it's, it's an example of people doing that. Even when they're like, just the most intimidatingly gorgeous, hot, unapproachable woman, and getting to a point where you just feel confident talking to that person and just are able to be yourself fully. If I were to have the men who, who approached me to watch this video before they approached me, it would have been a big help. I do wish that guys who approached me would have this information and know how to, know how to do this.
Getting her world is perhaps even more powerful for guys in relationship. There were things in the first segment with Karina that where he stayed open that I could have used today with my wife. I've been with my wife for uh, 10 years and there's uh, a lot of history that you bring to that. And I really like the idea of uh, bringing freshness to it. Decker's interaction with his wife, the kind of quality of them interacting in a way where, you know, one moment it looked like they've known each other for decades, the next moment it looked like they literally just met and are flirting in a completely fresh way. You having trouble with that strap though? Yeah. <laughs> Only if I'm trying to keep it on. Let's play a game. Uh, you're not asking me the right questions. <laughs> <laughs> That was just really amazing to watch and super inspiring. It's like, wow, I want to have that. You can kind of let go and rediscover in this moment who we are together and who you are and who I am. Getting Her World is not about being like Decker. It's about seeing new possibilities. When I think about guys watching this, I'm excited about them seeing new possibilities. Not necessarily seeing the right way to do it, but seeing that they're options are getting broader. Like, oh, I wouldn't even thought to take it there in that situation, or I wouldn't have said that, or if I had, it seems like she wouldn't have opened up in that way. I think you're like a dream girl for a lot of guys. <laughs> I think a lot of men don't even know to want or expect this kind of intimacy that it's possible. This will impact your relationships with everyone. The fundamentals are about humanity and it, it translates to the men in your life, your family, your co-workers. My relationship with my son, my parents, my mom, the guy at 7-Eleven, my ex, about to make love with a woman for the first time. Your friends were a stranger. I don't think there's an area of my relationships that wouldn't see a difference. I don't know a more empowering ability or superpower to have than the ability to especially get the world of someone who you uh, might find yourself trying to impress or prove something to, but to get your attention off of yourself and really get where they're coming from, that's, that is the art of a powerful interview or uh, a powerful uh, negotiation, business conversation, any conversation. Getting her world is not a Decker-only skill. We've learned it and you can too. It's extraordinary, but it's not extraordinary in the sense like I could never do that. It's extraordinary just in the sense of the results that he gets and venturing into territory that I just never, it never occurred to me before. What he's doing, anyone can do. Getting her world works. I practice this way of being with women all the time. I am already bringing some of the stuff into my, my current relationships. It's not about memorizing stuff or making stuff up or, you know, anything. So in a way, it's super, super simple. He uses very ordinary language. There's not a whole lot of, you know, fancy stuff to memorize or anything like that. It's very easy to do once you see how to do it. I think it's extremely accessible. What we're sending out and offering you is dense and practical and relevant to the kind of interactions that I'm clear a lot of, a lot of men are wanting to have. So if you're checking this out, I think, I hope, that you're pleasantly surprised at how useful and enjoyable the process will be of, of breaking these scenes down play by play together. For you watching this video right now, you can do this. You can do this in your life. I think when you start to see how there's such a beautiful natural flow to these conversations, you'll start to see how you can have that for yourself. And I'm excited to interact with women again in a whole new way. You know, I, I just can't see how it will ever be the same again. It's just so awesome. I don't even have words to describe it. It's something that I, I'm really looking forward to incorporating more and more in my life. Watch this, you know, watch this once. Do it. I mean, honestly, it's like the clock's ticking, the calendar's flipping, your life is, you know, it's like the, Fight Club thing. It's like your life is happening.